And welcome to FabPilot. So in this first video, I want to give you a quick tour of the platform to help you find your way around. Uh, when you first start your free trial, you'll notice this message that your instance is being loaded uh, with some files and configurations. So this will take about a minute to load, and then we'll have all our modules available. Great, so this is our home screen. What we have here is the available modules. And depending on the license you've purchased or the assigned user role, uh, you might have fewer modules available. Uh, here we have all the modules of a standard license with the permissions of an owner. Before we dive into these modules, uh, you'll notice this help menu up at the top here. So if you get stuck or if you want to give us some feedback, uh, you can do that right here. Uh, so now let's take a look at the modules. So the first module is called My Projects, um, and here is where you'll be able to upload your files, review, repair, optimize, generate quotes, and place orders. Next, we have Production. This is where your production team will be able to review the items that are ordered, batch the items into jobs using our auto-routing feature, prepare nestings, and manage the entire production workflow. Uh, then we have the dashboard. So this is where you'll find the historical machine performance, the real-time status of your production lab, and live machine status. Next is admin. This is where you'll be able to customize FabPilot to your lab with machines, materials, cost groups, users, options, basically everything you'll need to personalize can be done right here. And finally, we have the Learning Center. So this is where you have the documentation for each module. You will also find the change log, where we report the developments that are deployed every two weeks. So this is a quick overview of FabPilot interface and modules. I hope you found this video helpful. And if you have any further questions, please let us know in the comments section below.